Restaurant owner in Doretta is assessing the damage of his restaurant after it caught fire last night. KPLC's Haley Jefferson visited the scene and spoke with some about losing the community staple. Hickory Smokehouse, what many Doretta residents are calling a hometown staple, went up in flames Tuesday night. I'm very sad about it. It's just, um, it's really like a sad sight to see. I know the place has been here for a long time. My parents used to eat here all the time when they were younger too, so. It's just kind of sad to see that it's gone. Theo Anderson, owner of Hickory Smokehouse, says he was at home last night trying to stay warm when he got a call from the sheriff's department saying the building was on fire. We, we jumped up and uh, drove straight over here and it was uh, fully engulfed when we got here. There was already several fire engines here. Anderson says he does not know the exact cause of the fire yet. I'm even more more proud that of all the the kids and stuff that have had their first job here. Uh, we've just got a deep roots in the community and we want to continue that. Hickory Smokehouse has been around since 1977 serving the community. Uh, it's, it's terrible. Uh, we've been next door to, to Theo for 40 years. So to see a stable in the community leave, it's, it's devastating. Anderson says he's still in shock about everything. Don't know what we're going to do. Uh, you know, of course, we want to try and rebuild and because uh, we've, we've been here for a long time. Currently, Anderson is the owner of three restaurants. Hickory Smokehouse in DeRitter was the first one he ever bought. In DeRitter, Haley Jefferson, 7 News. We reached out to the Doritter Fire Department who say they're still investigating the cause of the fire.